Welcome to the Game Audio Resource WiseCube 2019 Audio Implementation Guide Series. In this guide we'll highlight how to randomly trigger a visor dialogue while playing a single player map based on the player character's health value. The process listed in this guide is not the best practice. Please use this guide as a way to boost your own WISE creative knowledge and improve your own project soundscapes only. In this step we will set up a basic blend container structure that will trigger different advisor dialogue based on the player character's health value. Navigate to the Project Explorer Audio tab, Master Mixer Hierarchy, Default Work Unit, VO Audio Bus. Right click the Audio Bus, then select New Child Audio Bus. Name it Advisor underscore generic underscore health. Select the new Audio Bus, then in the Properties Editor, Auto Ducking tab, Use the Insert UI button to add the following paths. Master Audio Bus, VO, then Dialog underscore Player. Change the volume to minus 96. Change the fade out to 0.2. Change the fade in to 0.2. Then add Master Audio Bus, then Music. Change the volume to minus 4. Change the fade out to 0.2. Change the fade in to 0.2. Then change the curve to logarithmic last in the list. Change the recovery time to zero. Locate and select the audio bus advisor. In the properties editor auto ducking tab, click on the insert UI button. Then add the following path. Master audio bus VO advisor underscore generic underscore health. Change the volume to minus 96. Change the fade out to 0 0.3. Change the fade in to 0 0.3 and change the curve to logarithmic last in the list. Navigate to the Actor Mixer Hierarchy, Default Work Unit, Advisor Wise Work Unit, Advisor underscore generic Actor Mixer. Right click, then select New Child Random Container. Name it Advisor underscore generic underscore player underscore character underscore health. Select the random container. Then in the Properties Editor General Settings tab, Play Mode, add the following settings. Tick Continuous. Tick the loop box. Then tick Transitions. Change the drop down menu to Trigger Rate. Change the Turiation value to 25. Double click the randomizer icon to open the randomizer property window. Tick Enabled. Leave the min offset value at 0. Then change the max offset value to 5. Close the randomizer window. In the Properties Editor States tab, Click on the Add State Group UI button. Then add the following path. Default Work Unit, then Player Life. In the list, change the voice volume of the dead line to minus 96. Select the random container. Then in the Properties Editor, General Settings tab, Output Bus, tick Override Parent. Then assign the following path. Master Audio Bus, VO, then Advisor, underscore generic, underscore health. Select the new random container. Advisor underscore generic underscore health. Right click, then select New Child, Blend Container. Name it Advisor underscore generic underscore player underscore character underscore health underscore blend. Right click the new blend container. Then select New Child, Random Container. Select the new Random Container. Then in the Properties Editor Advanced Settings tab, add the following. Tick Ignore Parent. Tick Limit Sound Instances. Change the value to 1. Then in the drop down menu, change it to globally. Change when priority is equal to discard newest instance. Copy and paste the random container into the same hierarchy location so you have two random containers. Name the two random containers individually advisor underscore generic underscore player underscore character underscore health underscore high and advisor underscore generic underscore player underscore character underscore health underscore low. Drag in associated one-shot dialogue audio assets to each of the two random containers. Place the assets under the path SFX advisor then player underscore character underscore health. Select the parent blend container. Then in the properties editor general settings tab click on the blend track edit UI button. In the blend track editor window Click on the new blend track UI button to add one new blend track. Then add the following. Name the track player underscore character underscore health. Tick the crossfade box. Then add the following path. Game parameters, default work unit, then player health. 
Close the Blend Track Editor window. With the blend container selected, in the Contents Editor Blend Track List, assign the two random containers to the associated named content. Open the Blend Track Editor again. Add the following settings to the graph individually. Player underscore character underscore health underscore low, change the start value to zero and the end value to 50. Then for the player underscore character underscore health underscore high, change the start value to 50 and the end value to 100. Close the Blend Track Editor window. Navigate to the Project Explorer Events tab, Events folder. Locate and select the event Map underscore loaded. Then in the Event Editor list, right click, then select New Action, then Play. Select the event's new play action line. Right click, then select New Action, then Play. Select the event's new play action line. Navigate back to the Actor Mixer Hierarchy Advisor Work Unit, then Advisor underscore generic underscore player underscore character underscore health random container. Drag it onto the new event play action line. Select the new event play action line, then change the delay value to 1. Navigate back to the Events tab. Locate and select the event death underscore player. In the event editor list, right click, then select new action, stop, then stop. Navigate back to the actor mixer hierarchy, advisor work unit, then select advisor underscore generic underscore player underscore character underscore health random container. Drag it onto the new event stop action line. Navigate back to the events tab. Locate and select the event map underscore completed. In the event editor list, right click, then select new action, stop, then stop. Navigate back to the actor mixer hierarchy, advisor work unit, select the advisor underscore generic underscore player underscore character underscore health random container. Drag it onto the new event stop action line. Save your wise project updates and generate the sound banks. In this final step, we will test the advisor triggers random dialogue content based on the player character's health value. Boot up the game and connect WISE to the game. Change to the WISE profile layout. Filter the capture log by the WISE object, advisor underscore generic underscore health random container. Back in game, grab some rocket launch ammo, then damage the player character to either above or below 50 health value. Then simply wait for the advisor health audio content to trigger. Manor, find a first aid kit quickly. Add any balancing changes you wish to add. Close the game. Save your wise project updates and generate the sound banks. Finally, run a wise integrity report to validate your wise data hierarchy structure.